Hi, I'm Pastor Eddie Windsor. You know, the Bible tells us in Psalms, those that are planted in the house of the Lord will flourish. This probably at one time was a, a desert oasis. But what happened? Lack of water, lack of somebody tending to it. A few days ago, I was speaking to a person who had lived in the desert for many, many years, and they made the comment that they never thought that there would be so many palm trees and and golf courses. In fact, they used words to describe the desert like it, it was a wasteland. There was sand everywhere and sand got everywhere. And now as they look around, they're in, they're in awe to see what a beautiful uh, resorts and, and houses and golf courses. You know, a lot of people, they'll plant themselves in organizations. They'll plant themselves in a, in a good charity, but they'll maybe that that effort that they're putting their life into, maybe it is prospering, but when you look at their personal life, it's not prospering. And you're thinking, how is it that I'm pouring my life into this, but yet my personal life is not prospering? It's possible that with your life, life has not turned out the way that you had planned, and, and you may be thinking that it's too late for me, but uh, just like these palm trees, you know, it's really all about where a, tr a palm tree is planted. If a, if a palm tree is planted in the right place, it'll flourish. And if it's planted in the, the wrong place or in a, in, a, in, a, in a bad environment, then it's going to die. It, it's not going to flourish. And you know, the same is true with your life, your family, your marriage, your relationships. If they're not planted in the right, the right place, they're not going to flourish. And the Bible is so clear. Those that are planted in the house of the Lord will flourish. I want to invite you to join us at Champion Life Church. We have great children's ministry, youth ministry, adult ministry. We want to invite you to come on out, be part of Champion Life Church, and watch your life flourish.